Yo guys, what is up? I am Drea Dreamer, and today we are back in one shot. Last time we left off with me figuring out, well, not me figuring out, uh, the computer had to explain it to me, uh, the code ends now. Oh, thank you for holding the elevator door open for me, mister. No prob. Hop in. Cool. So now we're going to the ground level. Yeah? Elevators, man. Some of the most awkward situations you'll ever come across. Especially if it's a really, really long trip. And you're both going to a really, really high place. Sure is taking a while. Mm hmm. Goodness gracious, I'm stuck in an elevator with the Messiah, and also literally God Himself is this. Op this is awkward. Oh. <laughs> I didn't read that right the first time. And also, literally, God themselves, this is awkward. Oh, maybe we can chat to pass the time, then. You heard me? I mean, sure. Alright, Andrea, should I ask about his job, ask about this city, ask about the library, or resume awkward silence? I hate awkward silences. Like, I'm not usually the one who break them. Like, as soon as a conversation gets going, I am all for it and I will keep talking. But I don't like breaking awkward silences. But in this situation, I don't think they're going to do that, and, uh, Nico seems ready to talk, so let's ask about his job. So, what do you do at your job? You seem really busy. I, uh, I fix lights, mostly. But now I also deliver and refill high-energy phosphor to structures that need them. High energy? You know, the super concentrated glowy stuff they had to process in factories. It's what powers most of the city stuff. Ooh. We used to have a small army of delivery robots doing that. But lately a bunch of them have been breaking down. So until they fix them, I'll just have to have more work on my plate. I haven't slept in so long. Well, will the robots get fixed? I have no idea. It's all up to the scientists over at the labs. But they seem really concerned about something else lately. Oh? Never a good sign when even the smart folks are worried. Alright, Andrew, should I? Okay, let's ask about the city. The city is very big! It's smaller than it looks. It's getting pretty crowded, too. First there was the refugees from the Barrens, and now more Glen folk are, folks are moving in, too. Oh? It's just safer here, you know? I mean, it's not a haven by any means. That square stuff that we just saw? You get more of that here than anywhere else, apparently. Yeah, I only saw one of those in the Barrens. I noticed. We're lucky it only seems to affect the city's infrastructure. The landmass itself is still holding up. Which is good, since there isn't much solid land here in the first place. Alright, Andrew, should I ask about the library? Can you tell me about the library? I'm supposed to go there. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Oh yeah, that's one of my main delivery spots. Those reading lights are pretty high maintenance. But I always feel out of place surrounded by smart people. Well, I guess you're pretty smart yourself, so you'll fit in fine. You and Andrea. Yeah, I guess I'm smart. Okay, I was afraid that that was the elevator crashing. Anyway, it was nice meeting you, uh... Nico. Oh no, that's Nico speaking. Nico! Alright. See you around, kid. Gotta run now. Cool. He seems in a hurry. I guess we should hurry too, Andrea. People are counting on us. Let's go find that library. Cool. So, this is the big city. I really hope I did enough for the, uh, what's it called? The seed. Why is this so creepy? Uh, let's not, actually. I know there's an arrow pointing me in that direction, but... Are these windows missing? Oh no, that's a door. Hey, more people with inanimate objects for heads. Oh, hey there. You have a lot of fish! Yeah, I'm worried about them. Oh? I heard something about how the square particle stuff just took out a major pipeline. I guess I should take advantage of the running water while I still can. Well, that's sad. Oh, okay, so that's a sidewalk. Durr. Hey. Evening news, evening news. Are you here to purchase a copy? 
No? Newspapers are for grown-ups. Grown-ups? Yeah. What does that mean? It means people who aren't kids. Kids? Or aren't you a kid? I am a robot. Right. Hmm. Oh, there's a... There's stairs. It's like a pier. I really don't know where I'm supposed to be going, but... the library? Oh cool, hang on, there's some outside I wanted to talk to. I'll talk to the robot actually, but... Hello, person. The library is up ahead. Thanks! Cool. Who are you? When the world ends, would it be better if it was gone in an instant? We're slowly fading away. To be honest, I'd rather the former. Yeah, that's a good question. Like, if the world were to suddenly end, would you rather have it end, like, all at once, or would you rather- and like not even be aware of it, or would you rather have it like just die out slowly? Because I think I'd rather have, uh, like, it all end at once. Because like, if it dies slowly, then you have to like live with the knowledge that it's dying. What? But I didn't say anything. Well, stop staring at me then. I was just looking at your book. Yes, you are in a library. There's books in the library. Jeez, um, go book the chatty one upstairs. Okay. Are you- is this off? It's currently off, okay. Are you the chatty one upstairs? Oh, hello, do you need directions? Let's see. This area here is mostly historical accounts. The reference section is downstairs and, uh, not sure where the children's section is. Sorry. That's okay, I'm not really looking for books. Oh, are you here to look for the author then? No? Oh, that's good. Or, I mean, that means you won't be disappointed. I've been volunteering for, here for months and I've never seen him. Not even once. He works together with the head librarian on publishing, so you'd think he would at least show up once in a while. But, he doesn't? Yeah, he seems kinda reclusive. Which is weird for a guy who supposedly travels the world. Maybe it's just around people. Hmm. Yeah, who is the author? Because we've heard him, I guess mentioned before, and, you know, they never seem to really amount to anything. Some sort of plaque. Okay. Books are neatly placed on the shelf. Okay, so I need to find... Poo? Okay, hi. The author is so cool. I heard he can travel all over the world with a flying machine. That's how he gathers materials for his books. Sorry. Ripping again. Wow! Cool. Yeah, right now this is reminding me a lot of Undertale, like, with all the, uh... Like, just all the lines right now. But, like, overall this hasn't reminded me of Undertale that much. Um, what are you doing to that book? Don't worry, these are my own books that I wrote. I just pulled them off the shelves to modify them. I have to cross out some sections. Most sections. Uh, how come? Because otherwise they'll think I copied him. Him? The author. I mean, I really don't see the point of writing anything anymore. The author is just going to write about the same thing and then everyone will love it. Nobody's going to remember the books that came out before his. Oh, uh, I mean, I ain't Hayden. You can see why people go nuts over his stuff. That guy's got major talent. But it just hurts. You know? It's never fun when people call you a copycat for something you wrote about first. I can see that. People call me a cat all the time. <laughs> Even though I'm a person and cats are pets. And Mausers. I sure hope people don't think I eat mice. Heh, <laughs> then I guess we're in the same boat, kiddo. Yeah, that's something that, like, I haven't really experienced it on YouTube yet, but, like... I know that it's a thing that a lot of, especially smaller YouTubers, experience that, like, you know, they'll make a video, and then someone else will make a video on the same game, and they'll be, like, called a copycat. And, like, I, like I said, I haven't experienced that yet, but sure I will eventually. A big book with a black clo clover on the cover. The title says, A Comprehensive Guide to Phosphors. As a general rule, if a phosphor loses its glow entirely, it cannot be relit unless exposed to the sun. 
if the phosphor is merely dim, it may be possible to boost it through exposure to another phosphor of higher energy. But even so, the boosted phosphor will never turn return to its original brightness. Okay. Hang on, I gotta drink some more water. Out of the common fo- Is this really important? I'll skip through this and, like, you guys can pause it. But, yeah. Okay, that was that book. Oh, no, I don't wanna... No, 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 no. Okay. Uh, can I get over to that other book? I'd like to get over to that other book to read it. Unless... Oh, there we go. Big book with the black clover on the cover. The title says, Emergence of New Ecological Niches in a Post-Sun World. Okay, again, I'll read through it myself, and I'll make it faster, and you guys can pause it if you want to read it yourselves. Okay, that actually was not that much. Okay. Can I talk to you? The author's latest books are really something, yeah? The head librarian just released a bunch last week. Oh? They're big compendiums. You'll see them if you look around. Kind of different from his earlier works, though. I'm used to reading his travel logs and novels, mostly. That's cool. So, where am I supposed to find the thing I need to read? Hey. Excuse me. Oh, you are the messiah. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. Guys, look at this robot. This robot is so cute. Welcome. When I first entered the city, a big robot told me to look for a library on the surface. This is the same library, right? Affirmative. Oh, goody. Well, we're here. What do we do now? The big robot only said, said there'd be clues here. That is the question for the head librarian, George. Allow me to call her. Okay. I won't question the name. Hey. George gonna pick up. She is not picking up. Is she not here? She is here. She is in the archival room upstairs. When she is concentrating on her work, she will ignore any and all phone calls for several days. Yikes. Can you go get her in person then? Leaving this post is not in my programming. Then, can I go myself? Of course. The archival room is accessible through the stairwell behind me. Gotcha, thanks. Okay, let's go. Unauthorized entry. Library card required for further access. Wait, what? Library card required for further access. I don't have a library card, though. When, where can I get one? This is a question for the head librarian, George. Allow me to call her. Ugh. I skip this. Can't skip this. She is not picking up. I figured. Are you sure you can't just let me through? Letting you through without a library card is against my programming. What? Even in an emergency? My programming is not flexible. I have not been tamed. <sighs> okay. So I gotta get a library card. Cool. That's awesome. I'm on my third cup. I can't feel my limbs. Um, but I have to stay awake. I need to find out how this book ends. Um, curse the author and his beautiful cliffhangers. Aw, oh, that's unfortunate. So where am I supposed to get a library card? I can't just, like, steal one, can I? Hmm. Is there where I can get a library card? 
Hello, person. Hi. Reshelving in progress. Please watch out for potential falling books. I will. Okay, wait, I have an idea. I still have this book with me. Wait, that's not what I wanted to do. Can I... Oh! There's this book I found back in the Baron's area. Since this is a place for books, would you happen to know what it says? I do not recognize this language, but the symbol on the cover is of importance. Oh? The head librarian, George, can explain it. Would you like me to call her? Please don't. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my god. Please, yes, do not call the head librarian again. Uh... So, what do you think about the author? I... don't know. Have you read his stuff yet? If not, you should. Cool. Let's just walk up to everyone with this book. The author publishes books at a highly accelerated, almost inhuman pace. In fact, he has put out more books in one year than most authors do in a lifetime. According to the head librarian, there's still a large ama of amount of material- There is still a large amount of material he has written, but not yet published. One cannot help but wonder where he can get so much done in so little time. I did the calculations and the numbers simply do not add up. Maybe he can stop time? No such mechanism exists in this world. Is that actually possible in your home dimension? No, I just saw it in a movie once. About superheroes and stuff. You're going through these pages pretty fast. Actually, it's mostly pictures. Oh? Yeah, the author doesn't only write books, he also illustrates them. Sometimes he makes books out of only pictures. Neat. That's pretty cool. Okay, uh, you... Oh, and picture books, those two. I like pictures. Okay, I don't remember what the rest of the conversation was, but... Okay. No, 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 I don't need this. Okay. Hmm, I never talked to you. The author's books cover a wide range of topics. It seems there are no subjects he does not write about. Quite the Renaissance man, don't you think? I guess so. But he's been focusing on documenting the world as of late. Oh? They say the city is the last bastion of civilization. Soon, these books may be the only thing we have to remember the rest of the world by. Ah. Maybe this lady up here can help me. Uh, no, that's not what I want to do. I wanted... Can I... Can I... Can I talk to you? No, it... Uh... Or know what he looks like. Everyone's heard of him through second-hand accounts, though. Oh, but he did reply to my letter that one time. I got it framed immediately. Nice. Okay. Where am I supposed to get a library card from? Hmm. Huh. Oh, wait. Well, I think I changed at least half a book's worth of content. Even then, it's still too similar. Looks like I'll just have to accept my fate. Well, I guess being called a cat isn't all that bad. As long as people don't assume you don't you eat mice. Okay, yeah. Okay, so... Is there no way I can, like... Hmm. Huh. Coffee machine. It's almost empty. Yeah, probably thanks to that guy over there. Hmm. Interesting. Well. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. So, actually, I think I'm going to leave this episode here. We got stuff done. Um, I think. Yeah, we did. We got to the city, first of all. But yeah, and we're now in the library, so next time we need to find a library card so we can get to George, and then we should be good, maybe, possibly. But yeah, I think that's going to be it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, and I'll see you next time. Bye. Love you.